Hi, welcome to Toy Brief. Today I'm going to talk about painting on your vinyl toys and how to clear the old toy off first. Um, this is a teeter. You can see at the edge of the screen. I've taken half of his paint off with acetone just as a test to see uh, how the acetone works with this stuff. This is acetone. What you're going to do if you work with acetone is wear rubber gloves and get a rag. And basically you can just, you know, wet the rag, wipe it down, get a clean spot of the rag, wipe it down, and you'll take the paint right off. An easier thing to do, I find, I'm a little too impatient for this, because sometimes it leaves little gummy spots. Sometimes it takes it all right off, but you're left with a couple different colors that the original was in anyway. This is a old Joe Ledbetter Dunny. The head was brown, the body's orange, and the arms are white. What you're wanting to do is primer anyway. So why bother taking all that paint off? Just primer it white. Um, you'll end up going over the thing. You won't even be able to see. Most of the time you won't be able to see any of the stuff underneath. A couple of coats of white. Sometimes you'll get little raised paint lines. If you run into that, just grab some 400 grit sandpaper. Just rub it right off. Recoat it with primer. You're good to start again. Um, it's real easy. Some people take their toys apart and do them. Some people keep them together. That's just a personal preference. I like to keep it all together and do it. So it makes it a little more difficult to get in some of the fine areas, but you can deal with it. So leave a comment here with your tips and tricks for customizing. Share the knowledge. Share the wealth. Thanks for watching. Check out toybreak.com.